So far we have demoed filtering from a user perspective. Now let's demo how to filter data according to the developer requirements. So we switch over to our code, to our show orders class, and we'll use the very intuitive where property and add to it a filter saying ship city is equal to and select the value. Okay, so by adding this line, we add a functionality to filter the data to show us only records that matches the filter criteria. We can even extend the filter criteria and say something like or orders.shipcity is equal to Madrid. And now we'll, show, we'll see only rows that are matching the Madrid criteria or the London criteria. Okay, now it's very important to emphasize that these uh, abstract definitions are later translated to the best syntax for every gateway that requires them. It will go to SQL as they like it, Oracle as they like it, XML, uh, uh, SQLite, and any other database according to the way the database needs it. You don't have to worry about which database you're writing with, you just care about what you want to write. Okay, next we'll define the sorting, which as you probably have guessed, We'll use the order by keyword and say order by orders dot order date and then we can select the direction. We can say ascending or descending, whatever we prefer. And again, the code behind the scenes will generate the best SQL and the best API calls to the appropriate database.